Hey guys, welcome back to Resident Evil, episode 35 of Resident Evil The Director's Cut. We are still in the laboratory, as in the last episode we entered new, new rooms, killed quite a few zombies, found another save room, and then we ended up in this room, which had a gas puzzle in it again. It took us a while to get this into position, I just I did it during the split, the split between 34 and 35, so we are here now. There is an air shaft. Will you enter it? Yes. So, th yeah, 34 was more, more exploration of the laboratory. We found out there is something sinister in B4. Which is not going to be good. Oh, sweet Jesus, what are those? Are those bodies? Oh, no. What's this? Oh, yes. Now I feel a bit more better. I have more magnum. Although these bodies are creepy. I mean, you were locked. I don't know why. What are the bodies? This place seems to be a more. Yeah, I do not want to stay here as long any longer. It's a passcode output machine. If I had an MO disc, oh, okay. The MO discs go here. Strange place to put them in a morgue. You unlocked it. Okay, just wanted to double check what's this. No, it's just a cardboard box. That guy, the guy from Metal Gear isn't in there, is he? I hope not. So I need to go to the discs now. You're not, you're not back again, are you? What the fuck? I killed you three times! Stay dead! You sneaky son of a bitch! Look, to stay dead like him. Why do you keep coming back? He's like the Terminator or something. He just won't die. What is these things? I mean, this time I blew his head off. Wrong way. What else can I do to kill him? If I had a grenade launcher, I could do something. Seriously, three times is enough. Well, I've actually killed him. Was it two times or was it three times? Whatever, I've killed him more than once. He should be dead. Uh, where's the ammo discs? Might as well put you back from there. Where's the other one? There's the third one. It just won't die. I bet he's back again now. Game, stop spawning these dead zombies. I've killed them once. I killed them twice. I don't need to do it a third time. I don't even need to do it a second time. See, he's dead. He's dead. I swear to God. Right. Good. Stay dead. Get the, get the hint. We don't like you. Stay dead. Maybe they just keep getting up until you destroy their heads. Maybe they're a different type of zombie. You have to kill them with the head. With the head. Well, you have to shoot the head off, otherwise they keep getting up again. And number one. Oh, number two, sorry. Pasco two. Can't read it. I will surely bless you and make your descendants as numerous as the stars in the sky. And as the sand on the seashore, your descendants will take possession of the cities of their enemies. That sounds pretty cool. Thanks for the, you know, nicely Genesis 2217. It reminds me of that Final Fantasy um, 7 Crisis Core. Some, it's something like that anyway. My my offspring will do that. Thank you. I have already had the. Uh, no, I need the other ones. You can't. What? Oh, oh, I see. Oh, okay, I got gotcha. you. There is more than one of those machines. I need to find the other three. Uh, two rather. 
That's fine. I have no idea where they are though, but... I might as well keep them on here then. So where would these codes likely be? Probably in the room with three bleeding zombies in it. I might as well go there then. I swear if you came back then, I'd have kicked some ass. They must be a type of zombie where if you don't actually blow off their heads, they just get up again. That sucks. Well, if, if that's the case, then I either kill all three, behead them, or literally just don't come in this room ever again. Double hit on that guy. These things are creepy as shit. Oh. Oh. Go with plan A. Boom. You ain't getting up again. What the? Another one. Oh, that's why they were in here. Oh, you sneaky sons of bitches. Checking all the chariots. Excite 1998. That's why they're in here. They were checking out this bird. This lady. Aha! There is one of these machines in here. Passcode 1. I swear by myself, declares the Lord, that because you have done this and you have not withheld your son, your only son. That one makes no sense. There is a third machine somewhere. Nothing special. So basically all four of these guys were hiding in here because of the a picture of a lady on the wall. Facts. To General Manager of Sanitation Division from Special Committee and Disasters Raccoon Special Research Department. That's a, that's a mouthful. This... M this memorandum, or whatever it is, is strictly confidential and must be destroyed as soon as it, as it is understood. Well, I've got it now. Regarding the T-virus outbreak which occurred recently, this committee conducted a field survey. According to the survey results, estimated on the amount of damage caused by the accident are considerably greater than reported earlier. First, although this is very difficult to obtain accurate data in terms of actual numbers, it is thought that more than half of the researchers died after exposure to the T-virus. The body count is most likely to increase since, ne since nearby all the survivors show symptoms of yeah, you know, particular to the T-virus. Second, our security system is still in operation, however our special security guard squad has been nearly destroyed. Because of that research information considered by our company to be top secret has been made available to outsiders. Countermeasures should be taken as soon as possible, which should make more or less kill them. Finally, many of the subjects from the experiment have escaped and are out of control. Shit. We believe that some researchers were killed by these subjects and their bodies were mutilated. By curious coincidence, these events are proof that of the success of our research. However, there are also a bit very high risk that th this news may be leaked to the press if we don't act immediately. The condition is very serious. Our operation to cover up the situation is difficult to attain, however we hope to that the problem will be solved quickly. We are separately concerned that the state police and stars are intervening too quickly. We need to act on the situation as well. That's a lot of reading. I'd rather just take in a switch for the air. Can and can we turn it on? Get some air? Nothing special. Aww. Oh, there's nothing else. It's a shame. So the passcode is basically some random guy. Like, just talking nonsense. I guess. You don't get it. Basically, we have to go in the maze area now. If we don't have anything else. Passcode panel. You've entered the passcode. You've entered the passcode. I need one more. I get the feeling... If you, uh, if you notice on the minimap, the... You have the maze room, 
And then the room at the very bottom with the rectangle in it, it's got to be in there. Son of a bitch. My phone is going off. Well, messaging me. I'm sorry, I'm currently busy. If I have had my own way, I had my own office. My own through like computer screens, big machines, big capture devices, nice wires. I don't all that. I don't. I have the basic stuff, and I'm gonna do try my very hardest. Yes. Here we go again. Look. I don't have any of the guns. I've killed you once. Stay dead. Where are you? You're dead. You're up as well. I need you. You're just gonna skip past you. Why are they coming back? This is not right. What the hell's that noise? What in the hell is that? Creepy shit is this? Some areas do not have power. Will you activate the black area? Yes. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, you son of a bitch. What the hell is that? Am I okay? I need to reload anyway. What the hell is this thing? Creepy, and they're on the ceiling. Oh, not again! Okay, we got past the first section. Now we're in the second one. Get out of here, you freak! It's a past. Ah, there we go. Oh, it's in here. Okay, then I'll just get on with that one. Let's go three. And and oh, I see. The, oh, I see. I get it now. And through the offspring, all nations on earth will be blessed because you have obeyed me. So get the first bit and the second bit and the third bit. Okay, that's why the first bit sounds confusing. There is another one of those things coming at me. I think. Or is that just steam? Maybe it was just steam. No, it's one of them things. I see him. Are you stuck? Excuse me. Ah, you missed. What is that thing? That is a creepy sh Oh, there's another one. Ah, the door's right there. Yes, I've just squeezed through. <laughs> what the fuck are these things? Big room, scary. Why am I doing here anyway? There's not much to do in here. A power... Okay, that's steam. A power connection switch. The elevator is off. Will you connect it? Yes. The power for the elevator is activated as the power supply and the circuit have been connected. Okay, so I needed to do that other bit first. Otherwise, I'd not have got that on. Now, there's another computer here. It's a triggering system activator. It's quite big. Trigger it for what? So I've got all the switches and the power is now on again, which is good. Now, we just have to dodge these mutant sons of bitches again. Ow! Ow! What are you? Keep on alive. Keep on alive. I think I killed one. There is one in here, I believe. Caution. Okay, you're that way. I'm going this way then. Bye. Yeah, where'd you come from? Nah, <laughs> yes. What the hell are those things? They're like mutant Batman. Well, not Batman, it's mutant shit. I don't know what they are. Zombie. Is 
Zombie? Zombie? Where did he go? What, what's going on with his spawning? What? I'm just gonna use this life. Something f weird's going on. Who we take the green herb? Yes. Uh, use fine yellow. Okay. Now we're gonna ch put the code in and check that little section, and then we have an elevator. We're not going to the elevator yet, we have one room left. Well, we have a door, and then we have a corridor, and then another room. That's it. I swear. Okay. That's good. That's good. That's good. Yes. Oh, no, it's in here. Yes. Hope you're enjoying these series. I mean, it's the first Resident Evil we've done. We haven't done it yet. We are very close to... Oh, there we go. Doors open. Okay, so it's a corridor and a room. As long as there's nothing in here that's going to kill me straight away, I'm okay. So far, so good. I can't hear anything, by the way. Remember that. Oh. Chris! Huh? Jill! Chris, what? Wesker, he is... I, I know. Shoot, it doesn't open. Look, Jill, wait here. I'll save you. Okay, I'll wait. Whoa, hello, Jill. So Jill's been kept as a prisoner. The door is tightly locked. How do I open it? So Jill's been kept as a prisoner. Interesting. I actually forgot about it. <laughs> I completely forgot about it. I'm sorry, Jill. You know. So somebody has locked Jill away. The uh, question is why? Or who, why, and when? B2's done. B1's done. B3's no less done. We have an elevator. So that's no good. Oh. Uh. Well, then, we have. B4 to look at. That's not going to be good. That's going to be pleasant. Ah, you're dead this time. I wonder if he's come back. Where did he go? I have no idea anymore. Not a clue. I think this wraps it for this episode, I think. I mean, we have literally nothing. We'll probably do these slides. Uh, there is not much I can do. We'll just save it again here. I'll use the one. Where's the one? Where's the one? So, again, I hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you have, make sure you to, to subscribe for more content. We don't just do Resident Evil, we do Call of Duty, Minecraft, all the, all, you know, all that stuff. Plus new things. I mean, this one is nearly end, so as I said before, we are going to play Resident Evil 2 and Code of Veronica. Which I've never, ever played before. So that is going to be interesting, because one, I've not played it before, and two, you get to watch me play and suffer. Because I don't know any of it. I don't even know a tiny 1% of it. So, I hope you enjoyed this one, as I said. If you, had, if you do like it, make sure you like, slap that like button. Oh, wait, I'm going to make a room left because I've just used it. 
Slap the like button, comment if you have any, and I shall see you for episode 36, which is going to be a B4. And I get the feeling, guys, we're not going to enjoy it. Something tells me hell is about to break loose. Literally. See you around, guys.